In August 1948, a young civil engineer and World War II veteran named Alfred Sanborn rented a small office in Toledo, Ohio. His first contract? To convert a boiler plate in Willow Run, Michigan from oil to coal. Despite these modest beginnings, Sanborn had big dreams and the talent to match. Al Sanborn set out to build a global company with foresight and agility, one that could build for the future, one that connected clients, colleagues, and communities with a shared belief in the values of optimism and philanthropy, a company that went beyond just evolving with the times and became a pioneering leader in the architecture and engineering industry. Sanborn's skill and ambition landed him even bigger contracts, and within that first year, he brought aboard a partner, Jack Steckety. Within 10 years, the firm had expanded globally with a $10 million contract for a carbon graphitizing plant in Monterey, Mexico. As the firm looked forward to expanding their breadth of offerings, architects Burry Otis and John Evans joined the team to create the legacy firm that is today, SSOE, Sanborn, Steckety, Otis, and Evans. Since our inception, SSOE has been dedicated to advancing the architecture, engineering, and construction industry. As early as the 1970s, when the height of technological innovation was computer-aided design, SSOE was one of the first firms in the United States to implement CAD to help our clients build their dreams. Throughout the years, SSOE has continued to lead the advancement, from our early commitment to computers, to early adoption of 3D modeling, virtual design and construction, and cloud-based technologies. We continue our commitment to innovation as we explore how digital transformation and AI can bring value to our clients. Our innovation doesn't stop at the design process. We bring this mindset to the facilities and manufacturing processes we design for our clients who are changing the world in major ways and meeting the day-to-day -day needs of our friends and family. We bring together people, processes, and technology to deliver integrated solutions for a wide range of client objectives and project needs. As we're looking toward the future for our clients and families, we're dedicated to saving energy, preserving water, minimizing waste, and reducing carbon emissions. While honoring the past, SSOE is also building the future. From our modest beginnings in 1948 in Toledo, Ohio, SSOE has expanded into a global firm with a presence in the US, Mexico, and India. In 1987, SSOE established its office in Nashville, and through a sustained commitment to growing this region, we've become a leader in the Southeast US, currently boasting five offices in four states. By the turn of the 21st century, SSOE has become one of the largest architecture and engineering firms in the US. We didn't stop there though. With the growth mindset infused into the culture by our founder, Al Sanborn, we make a conscious shift to grow through acquisitions, acquiring eight companies over a 17-year period. In 2012, we expanded into India with an acquisition that brought our Mumbai office and a critical talent pool that has expanded our engineering insights and capabilities. In 2013, SSOE expanded to the Pacific Northwest, bringing expertise in semiconductor and high-tech manufacturing. And in 2014, we brought our innovative services to Mexico, establishing our first Mexico office in Lyon to better serve the growing amount of in-country manufacturing clients. With the acquisition of Stevens and Wilkinson in 2021, SSOE reaffirmed our dedication to architectural excellence and further expanded our presence in the Southeast US. Our growth has spanned continents and decades, but one thing has remained consistent, our commitment to designing and building the future for our clients, colleagues, and communities. Throughout our 75-year history, SSOE's dedication to clients has helped us forge partnerships that last generations. Ford Motor Company was one of SSOE's first clients in 1948, and today, we're proud to continue to support the automaker, as well as others in the electrification of the automotive market. We've designed manufacturing facilities around the world, automotive assembly, distribution centers, high-tech environments, and clean rooms for semiconductor clients to power the technology at our fingertips. We facilitated the design of patient-centered hospitals, helping doctors and nurses provide medical care in a comfortable, safe environment. 
We've put food on the tables of millions of people through our work for clients who create healthy food choices for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And we're doing it all with an eye to the future. Whether it's making homes more energy efficient with roofing and insulation products, or pioneering the design of electric vehicle manufacturing facilities, SSOE is a global leader in forward-thinking design. We're breathing new life into historic spaces with adaptive reuse of once neglected buildings, redesigned for living, working, and leisure. We're designing for the workforce of the future as well, with state-of-the-art educational spaces revolutionizing higher education. SSOE's projects enhance everyday life around the globe, shaping the world we live in. At SSOE, our proud 75-year tradition of innovation is still going strong as we help our clients build a brighter world. At SSOE, we've built a reputation for taking on some of the most complex, high-stakes projects. In some cases, these projects have a global impact. In others, they touch the individual communities where we live and work. What makes all this possible? Our people. From the first partnership between Sanborn, Steckity, Otis, and Evans, and through the last 75 years, SSOE puts our people first because happy employees equal happy clients. Taking the best care of our employees is what has allowed us to provide the highest level of service to our clients. We've come a long way since 1948, but it's been a deliberate and continuous journey towards providing our employees the same world-class environment they designed for our clients. While our founder, Al Sanborn, may never have imagined the world we live in today, his commitment to our employees lives on in diversity, through outreach to underrepresented groups and in inclusiveness of those team members in our culture through employee resource groups that work to ensure everyone feels they can bring their full selves to work. In work-life balance, through programs like our hybrid work model and paid parental leave. In career support and advancement, through formalized career planning and career paths at all levels. In opening up ownership to the firm to nearly half of our employees, helping them become owners of their own company and even more as we go into our next 75 years. Since 1948, we've been employee-owned and employee-driven. In the early days, Sam Bourne personally stopped by every employee's desk. Today, we all work together virtually, sharing town hall meetings where everyone has direct access to leadership. This fosters teamwork and innovation and keeps everyone connected to what makes us successful as we continue to honor the past and build the future. Our employees come from all over the world with a vast diversity of experiences and skills. From Al Sanborn in 1948, to our retirees, to our long-tenured employees, to our newest co-ops and interns. After 75 years, SSOE owes our global success to our people. We are a product of these individuals and the skills and perspectives that they bring, enhanced by our collaborative and inclusive environment that elevates us all. This amazing team applies cutting-edge technologies and interesting projects with the world's most innovative companies, allowing creativity to take flight while changing our communities and the world. Our continuous efforts to grow the diversity of our team only makes this formula more effective.